about your breakfast. Are, are you the new butler? And don't you remember last night? Well, well, what happened to Godfrey? I'm Godfrey. Oh, you look so different. What happened to those nice whiskers? Oh, turn around and let me look at you. You're the cutest thing I've ever seen. Thank you. Will there be anything else? Yes, sit down and talk to me. I like to talk in the morning when your head is clear, especially if you've been somewhere the night before. Now, don't you think it would be better if I talked standing? No, because if you're uncomfortable, I'll get uncomfortable and forget what I have to say. You insist. But it doesn't seem very good form for a butler. Oh, you're more than a butler. You're the first protégé I ever had. Protégé? You know, like Carlo. Uh, who is Carlo? He's mother's protégé. Oh. You know, it's awfully nice, Carlo, having a sponsor, because then he doesn't have to work, and he gets more time for his practicing. But then he never does, and that makes a difference. Uh, yes, I imagine Do you would. play anything, Godfrey? Oh, I don't mean games and things like that. I mean the piano and things like that. Well, I... Oh, it doesn't uh, really make any difference. I just thought I'd ask. It's funny how some things make you think of other things. It's very peculiar. <laughs> it makes me feel so matured and grown up. Uh, what does? Having a protege. You're the first one I ever had. You've never had any others? No, you're the first one, and it's terribly thrilling. Not only does it occupy my mind, but I think it's character building, too. Mm -hmm. uh, just what does a protege have to do? Well, you just go on buttling, and I sponsor you, don't you see? It's getting clearer. It's really not much work. It gives you something to think of, and it's going to be such fun. <laughs> so I'm sure it's going to be heaps of fun. You see, for instance, if Cornelia got to meet or anything, you wouldn't have to do anything about it. You see, I take care of everything. You see, I'm your sponsor, and I just take a sock at her. <laughs> I hope that'll never be necessary. Oh, I just wanted to give you the idea. Well, that's fine, but you see, a protege has certain responsibilities also. For instance, if someone should ring for me now and I didn't answer, that would reflect upon you because you're my sponsor. Don't you see? Yes, I suppose I would. I never thought of that. You don't know how nice it is having some intelligent person to talk to. Uh, it's been very enlightening to me, too. Oh, I just thought of something else. Do you know what you are? I'm not quite sure. You're my responsibility. That's very nice. See you in church. Good morning. Fine morning, sir. Yes, it is a fine morning. Don't be in a hurry. You see, I'm the old-fashioned type, and I was also middleweight champion when I was in college. I thought you might like to know that before this thing starts. Well, you see, sir, I'm the new butler. I just served Miss Irene her breakfast. You always take a change of wardrobe when you serve breakfast? Oh, well, uh, I think this young lady can explain. Yes, he really is the new butler, Mr. Bullock. I can't imagine how his things got in the hallway. Well, I still don't get it, but if you are the new butler, why didn't you say so? I'm very sorry, sir. Uh, uh, may I? There's a man at the door to see you. I think it's another process server. Another one? Yes, sir. <clears throat> well, here I am again, Mr. Bullock, with another little present. Yes, I've him. heard all that before. Which one in the family is at this time? Miss Cornelia. It seems she's feeling pretty gay last night. And on her way home, she busted up a few windows along Fifth Avenue. And I'm sorry to give you that, but girls will be girls. Goodbye. Life in this family is one subpoena after another. Mr. Bullock, there's a handsome cab driver waiting to see you in the kitchen. What's he want? He wants $50 and his horse. What horse? The one Miss Irene rode up the front steps last night. Where is his horse? I haven't got it. It's in the library where Miss Irene left it. Well, do you begin to get the idea? <laughs> 